Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. This is Friday, January 10th at 6.48 p.m. And I just got on Facebook <clears throat> to, um, well, just to, you know, because I do a couple times a week or so to see who all has messaged me or whatever. Well, I got in my messages. Um, this is an urgent request for worldwide prayer for Australia. You know, they've been having all these horrible fires. And I saw in a video yesterday where they're just like the ones in Paradise, California, where lasers appear to be shooting down at them and then causing the fires. And get this. They even made it a law, according to the video I saw yesterday, against burning, uh, um, he couldn't think of what to call it. I said, that guy reminds me of myself. I said, I'm so glad I'm not the only one on here. And he, and he has a great following, but he, um, I'll find a video in my history and link it if y'all would like to watch it, but, uh, where people used to go and burn a big old circle around an area they wanted the fire to not go any further, like maybe a 10 foot um, um, area where they'd burn out the brush and stuff like that, uh, extra sticks, little trees, and when the fire got there, it would just stop. And just consume itself, you know, whatever's in the circle that they had put this. See, I can't think of it either. I thought I could think of it, but I, I couldn't think of it either. Anyway, they were asking everybody at 3 o'clock, uh, excuse me, where did I get a 3? 9 o'clock GMT. Now, I don't know when that is, but at 9 o'clock GMT, Everybody Google it and figure out what your time is GMT, 9 o'clock GMT. Is that Mountain Time, United States Mountain Time? I don't know. Everyone is asked to please join for three minutes to pray for Australia. Now, th this is something that... um I'll read what they're saying, and then feel free to leave a comment about, have you heard of doing this kind of praying, and does this sound fine with you? Visualize and ask for a ball of monsoon-type rain to fall, soaking every area where rains are falling Visualize the fires being put out and all the people and the animals safe. Visualize the re reeling, I'm sorry, feeling of relief and smiles amongst the people as cleanup begins and the air clears. Please pass this message on to anyone you know who would participate with us. The power of worldwide prayer is huge. Yes, it is. Okay, and that was put up by Jenny Rabby. I think that's how you would pronounce that. Or it could be Rabby, but uh, cause there's only one B. But anyway... That's the name on here. I'm, I don't remember. Sorry if I don't remember your name. Let me, um, how do I exit this? Make it smaller. It actually comes from Rick and Fiona Nuttall, um, who are my friends on Facebook. Okay, so they've been, they posted this from Jenny Raby and asking people to pass it on. Um, I guess what I can do is I'll figure out how to pass it on to these people on Facebook. I think you just click this little arrow here. Let's see. Remove, react, reply. 
Nope, that didn't help. Oh, wait, forward. You click that arrow. Anyway, I'm going to, um, I'm going to end this video and say I plead the blood of Jesus over this video, the internet connection, my computer, and each and every one of you, your devices, and your internet connections. And let's all remember to pray for three minutes straight or more. Doesn't have to be just three minutes. This is a lot of devastation down there. I can't imagine how many lives and homes, animals I know. The video I watched showed a whole bunch of animals. I forget how many billion. I mean, it was like something billion animals had been burnt or affected. Chased out, burnt to death, or at least burned. They showed a little koala baby, and it was all singed, but it was still alive for now. It could probably die by tonight from smoke inhalation. Believe it or not, that'll get you. It might take longer, but your lungs cannot handle it. They just cannot handle all that soot. All right, well, I'm going to end it here. Um, let's pray that the Lord God Almighty will drop balls of monsoon like rain on every area that's on fire in Australia tonight. And let's end this thing. Okay? Boy, I feel like I'm wearing goggles. So maybe these really do block the, um, the blue light because they, sh they give a different kind of glare, don't they? Okay. Well, I'll say bye for now, y'all. Talk to you later.